Hi, good morning. This is Rajkumar Arya, Associate Professor in Department of Chemical Engineering and IT Jalandhar. Today I am going to explain the modeling of batch distillation with, uh, with hold up. So, in that case, what you have so batch distillation is very commonly used where fresh speed is being put in this particular still and it's being provided by some heat here so you can continuously providing heated this heat will will convert it to the into the vapor and the vapor will go to inside the column column will have n number of trays here 1 to n now this vapor will go to the condensers and this would be collected in this particular condenser here and then they will be sent back as a reflux to the column and a displaced product is being withdrawn at a constant rate. So initially a high volatile component will go here, will reach to a maximum number of purity as some particular number of time, particular time and after and this particular product must be withdrawn at some rate from here. After that this component uh, co composition will keep on decreasing and it will reach the second component which reach in the highest percentage in the top product and we have to withdraw the <coughs> component 2 and uh, after some time again component 2 will vanish and it will become a very low composition then it will become richer in component 3 so within same uh, column uh, the multiple uh, cuts can be taken out from same column at a different different time intervals so here these are some uh, constraints which are always being considered theoretical trays equimolar overflow constant relative volatilities these are means always being considered here and uh, whatever you charge here you are charging is once as a fresh speed and uh, then we can write here material balance equation for still pot actually so still pot we can write here so the mass drop stage of change here the distillate be drawn from here then the component balance can be given here this is at the reflux here this is at the vapor rate and relativity so relative volatility this relation holds valid at each and every point then nth tray again we are taking here total mass balance in terms of component here x here then the relative volatility then and top and top tray again you are calculating r distillate here component at and tray then vapor here th then vapor uh, coming to that particular tray and then leaving the that particular tray and then the equilibrium the relationship between vapor and liquid the reflux drum so reflux drum will have here from there you are drawing the distillate so the vapor is coming here they are getting condensed so r plus t is is being withdrawn here and this is the total rate here r equal to v minus t so the reflux is vapor minus distillate only so these are nine model equations can be solved under uh, Understood it state operations and we can get the desired the result in this particular format. Thank you.